Hey everybody, it's Steve Hughes from Holders Air Conditioning and Heating. And today I'm in downtown Bakersfield at 19th and Q Street to preview this beautiful new four-story apartment building that's being built right here in the heart of downtown. It's surrounded by some great restaurants and centrally located, and this place is gonna be absolutely beautiful. We'll go check out our commercial division inside and see what they've accomplished so far. We'll get the tour and you'll get to see the potential of this four-story 50 unit apartment building here in downtown Bakersfield really shows. Enjoy the tour and thanks for watching. Morning everybody, Steve Hughes from Holders Air Conditioning and Heating and today we're with our commercial foreman, Orion Bachover. Orion, thanks for allowing me to come out here today. Can you tell us where we are and what this place is? Uh, yeah, so uh, thanks for coming out and taking a look at it. We're, uh, we're on the corner of 19th and Q here in downtown Bakersfield. Uh, we got a multi-family building going up here. It's four stories. Um, it's got corridor units. It's got uh, multiple dwellings everywhere. Um, we're running out uh, ventilation. We're running out um, split systems. They're all heat pump systems. Uh, condensers are all mounted on the roof. Line sets are running up to the roof. Um, we got all the ventilation running sidewall, except for on the fourth floor, that's going out through the roof. Okay. Um, one of the tricky parts about these multifamily, multi-story buildings is uh, the sequence of operations, like we were talking about a little bit earlier. Sure. Um, most times they, they got to get the roof on. And so in order to get the roof on and dried in, we kind of end up being last. So it takes a lot of coordination, a lot of planning to, to come and say, hey, this is where our stuff is going to run, lay it all out. And we end up being the last ones into a building. And our commercial department's experience really does benefit the contractors, both the subcontractors and the GCs because of our experience and knowing when to get in there and how to get it done quickly, right? Yes, sir. It takes a lot of coordination, a lot of planning, a lot of uh, knowledge of how certain different types of projects work, especially projects like this with these these multifamily, you know, multi-story buildings. Um, sequence sequence is key right um once the, once that roof's on and dried on then we get to go but in the meantime you've had plumbers already running everything in the walls you've had electricians they've already had to go ahead to run most of their stuff so like i said we're the last ones in um, we come in after what's called the preliminary drywall has been put in so um if you want to show you got some preliminary drywall that's gonna it's gonna block apart the adjoining hallway in this unit it's also going to create a fire barrier here between floors. So you also got to have knowledge of fire, fire stopping systems, different fire stopping details, uh, where, where fire coffee has to go. Um, once that drop is in, then we're free to come and hang our units. They, they're going to hang basically below the, the ceiling and this fire stopping system is preliminary drywall. Then you're going to have your, your duct work in your system. Below that, they'll typically have a drop, a drop ceiling system that runs mostly in the hallways, bathrooms, closets. And that's what's going to conceal the ductwork that's running to each room. Gotcha. How many units are in this building? Four stories. It's on the corner of 19th and Q. I mean, it's beautiful on the outside. How many units fully in this building? So dwellings, there's, uh, I believe it's 50 apartments. Nice. And then you've got eight hallway units and two common area units that are going to serve the offices. They're going to serve the, the lounge and, and where people come in to, to look at apartments to lease. And rent. Excellent, man. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Orion. I appreciate you taking the time explaining what we're doing out here. And I can't wait for this thing to open up. I think it's going to be great for downtown Bakersfield. Yes, sir. Thanks right for coming. On. Thank you.